eclipse happening in April of next year in Kentucky Anna is in the path. A total solar eclipse happens when the moon passes between the sun and earth completely blocking the face of the sun. April's total eclipse will be visible from Texas to Maine. People viewing the eclipse from locations where the moon's shadow completely covers the sun known as the total path of totality will experience a total solar eclipse next April. The sky will darken as if it were dawn or dusk. The April eclipse will be the last total solar eclipse eclipse visible from the United States until 2044. But to make this eclipse visible for the human eye, you need special gear. Here's meteorologist Christina San Juan with more. One of the essential items you'll need for the 2024 total solar eclipse, eye protection. You've probably seen the eclipse glasses. The sun could burn your retina while trying to stare unprotected at it and you may not even know damage has been done until it's too late. Now if you can't find your glasses from the eclipse in 2017 or you're just looking for another option, try this. A pinhole projector is an indirect viewing method and is easy to make using items you probably already have at home. Here's what you need. A cereal box, scissors, pen or pencil, paper, foil, and tape. I started by cutting out two square holes on one side of the box. Then, trace the other side of the box onto a piece of paper and cut it out. You'll then place the piece of paper in the bottom of the box before sealing it back up. Now grab your foil and tape it over one of the squares. Then you go on to poke a tiny hole into the center of the foil. Now it's time to test it out, so let's head outside. With the sun at your back, look into the open square and you'll see a projection of the eclipse sun on the paper inside the box. Ta-da! Now during the eclipse, you'll be able to safely watch the event unfold. It's never too late to start planning for the eclipse because hotels and Airbnbs are filling up. Luckily, we have an eclipse guide on where to watch for the best views. Just head to whas11.com for more.